Hello everybody, my name is Erdalan. I would like to learn you, learn you growing saffron indoors. As you can see in my hand, these beautiful flowers. Stay tuned with me for learning for growing saffron indoors in the environment completely controlled. Okay? This beautiful flower. I would like to tell you the story of growing saffron indoors. Stay tuned with me with the step by step. In the summer, you purchase the bulbs, and the summer after purchasing, you store the bulbs with the 25 centigrade and the humidity around 60 percent, and also in the autumn. In the beginning, you need to temperature around 20 centigrade. And gradually, you should decrease the temperature when the teeth reach to 3 centimeters. After that, when the buds or sprout reach to 6 centimeters and 10 centimeters, the time of the cold shocking. During 3 days, you should give the temperature around 12 centigrade during 3 days. After Seven days, the flowers gradually appear. And therefore, we have these beautiful flowers. We do not have any giving fertilizing, any irrigation during summer, it doesn't need. During autumn, also, it doesn't need to give any fertilizer because the bulbs should absorb the humidity from the relative humidity. Okay, during summer, during summer, the bulbs are asleep. Therefore, the bulb does not have any activity. Okay, we do not have any giving fertilizer or irrigation. During autumn, at the middle of, of autumn, the time, as because today is November 17, and also due, before flowering, in the, during autumn, also during flowering, we do not have any irrigation or giving fertilizer. The bulb doesn't need. The bulb save energy from last year, okay? During autumn, during summer, spring or also we do not have any irrigation. But the winter is the time of propagation. The most important for us, the giving fertilizer the giving irrigation. We mix off the fertilizer with irrigation and two stage, only two stage. The bulb of saffron needs to irrigation at two stage, at the beginning of winter and the end of the winter. At the beginning of the winter, after during 17 days, during 15 days, we have the flowering. After harvesting, we should keep the bulbs inside the greenhouse, okay? Inside the greenhouse and add the mix of the vermiculite and the soil in the inside to this. Even five centimeters, 10 centimeters depth cultivation depth, also enough for saffron. And it doesn't need to replace it to very big environment, okay? We keep after flower, we keep this flower in the winter and give the fertilizer. The first stage, at the beginning of winter, we give, we will give the bulbs of saffron, the nitrogen, phosphor, potassium, the macro element, and the algae C, algae C, and Acadia, three months later at the end of the winter, we will give trace elements and manganese, iron, and the finish. With irrigation, two stage at the beginning of winter, at the end of winter. But there are many questions, how many times we can harvest? Once is better. Twice we can, but the bulb damages. After flowering, after flowering, these bulbs gradually disappear. After one month after flowering, and the new bulbs will be appear three times after. It is better focus is one time at the middle of autumn because these bulbs will able in the one time gives you one and a half kilogram dry saffron. Okay? Once one and a half kilogram dry saffron is better, for example, twice. Okay, for example, triple, fourth, thirds, but even even a stage, for example, 30, 300 grams of dry saffron. We should focus in the ones what have because when we have the more than ones, the bulb will be 
damage okay the ones but the focus on the one the high quality we can even in the ones you have the high quality when you increase the time of the harvesting the bulb will be damaged and you will not you won't have any bulbs in the future these bulbs you should only once is enough for purchasing the bulbs and it's better purchase the very big bulb because this bulb with you even 10 years in 10 years you do not need to any purchasing you should only once purchase the bulb good luck you can also contact with me on whatsapp 0098-935-825-3945 if, if you need my books about the cultivation, more mushroom cultivation, saffron, growing saffron indoors, growing saffron and outdoors, you can text me in whatsapp and I will guide you how you can will be able to purchase my books or also have physical consultation or online consultation. Stay tuned and contact me, message me in WhatsApp 0098-935-825-0945. Good luck.